Last weekend, the Black Star Initiative and their ally, Invictus Galactic Federation, faced off against the Skunkworx Org in a three-hour battle for control of Ghost Hollow on Microtech. We recently showed part one of the battle here on the channel with the opening phase of the engagement. If you have not seen that video, check out the link appearing in the top corner of the screen right now. I would definitely recommend reviewing at the very least our plan, but there was a lot of cool action in part one as well. Just as with part one, I want to thank everybody that has sent perspectives of the battle for inclusion and a doubly big thank you to Roland Wright of Infend who contacted me in the comments to offer some footage from the other side. Really appreciate that Roland Wright, thank you. When we left things off, three of our four raccoon teams were in position, holding the perimeter of the AO, and our two Centurion had successfully landed, but the objective itself was still firmly in enemy hands. The time had come for us to breach Ghost Hollow itself, but Team 3, our designated reaching team, have not yet made the push towards the rack itself. Teams 2 and 3 had a less ideal ingress to the AO than we did, and we're going to see a little of it now before catching up to where we left things off. Do we have any fighter support at all out here? Well, they're doing the first punch now. It's gonna be spicy, people. We got two escorts on our Haku. side. As the ground teams were being inserted, the Hammerhead, which was damaged from a mid-air collision, was now under attack from torpedo ships like the Retaliator. Retaliator's coming back in. Norzek, one. Yeah, Norzek firing another size nine at us. Fire Gosh, the Retaliator. Yeah. Light him up, light him up. Alright, tally's red. Good job, guys. The Terrapin would have an atmospheric view of the battle ahead on approach. Overwatch with a three person team, so you need double. And with the threat of enemy encounter growing greater, Pilot Sathias makes the call to drop the troops. It is better to drop early and have the raccoons alive than drop late and have teams killed. Get ready guys, about to land, okay? Get ready. Remember drop order, y'all. It ain't a race to get out. Chips. Hey, Alright, Boys quick. out. Yeah, let's go. Chips out. Bringing supply boxes along would cause them a much more significant delay. You guys go. I can grab the box and I'll follow. I got it. I got it. I got it. Yeah, yeah let Jonesy got. Jo Jonesy has it. Don't worry about it. Let's link up with Royal. The two teams had a track ahead of them, though. Two kilometers holding supply boxes the whole way. What was that? Bourbon's got rear behind you. See, C2 coming in. Duffy Desperio, I've got contacts on the uh, on the wreck site. Clear to engage. Clear to engage, yeah. Copy. Yeah, this is Team 3. Uh, unfortunately, we were dropped a little too far out, so we are just at drop zone. We just you made it to drop zone. Contacts on. The hammerhead above was holding on in there, but in need of repairs. We definitely might want to consider repairing. What's their mother cruise ships like? We have to wait for the uh, the okay from Sony. Uh, Coco. Yeah, yeah we requested repair, a repair. repair. Yeah. Yeah, this is if this is a lull before the next wave, it would not be a bad idea. Say again. Once rhinos established and our air would be established, I'll Six. let you know. Do they have uh, monarch. Like we have tallied a total of two retaliators and that one A2 that used to drop troops. Troops. But as you may recall from part one, when the sun was rising, there was a surprising lull in the air combat, and Sony would give the green light for the hammerhead to go repair. Ten four. Right, hammerhead, if you're gonna repair, do it now. Roger, we're moving. We're moving to repair. The timing was maybe even fortunate as another threat would soon be spotted. Eclipse inbound, 75 high, three kilometers from Pole Cat's nose. The hammerhead is away, so we're okay for now. Raptor City time was ready to go for the Eclipse. We're looking at something over here. An eclipse? Eyes yeah. on, eyes on, eyes on. It's really effective. Our Captain Merrick will be able to catch up here in a second. Yeah. We've got top speed on him, so. Yep, and he should be dead here. There he good goes. Splash, good splash, good splash. With the hammerhead saved on its way out for repairs, we rejoined the ground where part one left off, and after eliminating three enemy ground teams, we were still spotting BSI and infrared reinforcements trying to make their way to the wreck itself. Um, contact, contact. Uh, to the left of the body, to the left of the body, moving towards the, uh, uh, moving towards the uh, wreck. Uh, in the tree line there. Uh, SVO2 Ira, we still got enemies in the woods to your. Give me cardinal directions, man. 
Team 3 were by now making their way to the Ghost Hollow Wreck from the southwest. We going in the front door and up the ladder, right? Yep. We probably have uh, the other team pushing, uh, pushing through the tree line to fair amount. Okay. Te uh, team 4, this is Team 1, can you push into the trees towards the outpost? Towards the outpost right now. Team 3 would make it to the wreck without resistance outside, but the defenders were not going to give up the site without a fight. The rhinos on ground. Team 3 are doing their push into the outpost now. Can you push up and support them? The ladder is a dangerous ingress route, as Team 3 were about to discover. Jing got entrance. I'm down. I'm, I'm getting shot. They're inside. They're inside. They're inside. Pull me out. Pull me out. I'm dead. We've got, we've got enemy inside the inside the climber. Inside the climber. Raccoon Jonesy had been taken out, but his body was recovered. And outside, Jafaro would catch sight of a team making their way to the wreck. Yep, yep. on the left side, of the very left side of this, you know, this tree group. Uh, left side of that tree group. Oh, oh and below yep, him, below eyes him, on. Him, below him. Two, two, one, one shot, shot by, by climbing, climbing bottom, bottom of the hill, below you were aging out. Okay, Ronnie, put some shots out. He's here, uh, decent. Oh, I got him. Team 3 would need another way in, but Barb and Jax would still send a little gift of Defender's way. I'm going to make entry from the outside through the side air lock. Oh, Shots above. Shots above. That was me, that was me, that was Barman, sorry. I was just uh, saying hello. He's re reviving. He's rising. Kill him. With the enemy air force still regrouping, our Raptors would destroy empty or soft dead ships remaining from the opening engagement. I mean, remember, there's a hundred player on this Air right assets, now, we have nothing so else to do. Might um, take a little bit let's go ahead and get rid of non-friendly, uh, I see a retaliator and some other random shit out here, let's get rid of it. On the hill, we get occasional sightings of BSI and infrared defenders poking out briefly from the wreck. If you can engage targets you see within the reclaimer, that would be a huge help for the teams going in. White suit entering starboard side aft section. Team 3, we just spotted someone in a white suit entering the aft section of the reclaimer. As Team 3 probe for a better route inside, they keep up activity at the ladder to serve as a distraction. Right, keep them distracted there. What's the plan? But it wouldn't take long for targets to begin appearing in the skies again. Break, 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 break. We have a hurricane coming in from up high, almost directly above us, Thunder Lake. See the light. He's diving yeah. down. Yeah, eyes on Thunder Lake. So eyes on, eyes on, eyes on, eyes on, everybody. Primary, primary, Focus, primary. Missiles, missiles free, missiles free. I was down, I was down. Yeah, he revived peak, mate. Dude, Barbara, why are you by yourself, man? Barbara had made an attempt up the ladder, but this time had at least survived the encounter and could be revived. Do we have friendlies within the reclaimer? Yeah. We do? Okay. In the front. In the skies above, our raptors were about to make contact once again. Contact. Norzek. Second contact. Norzek, Aegis Retaliator. With the hurricane. There were multiple targets dropping into the AO in a wide range of ships. Yep, sir. Target high. Mindscape. Redeemer, 16 kilometers right above. Did you brought a redeemer? They brought a redeemer, guys. Let's go say hello. But I don't think multiple contacts are coming in directly. Uh, there's a super hornet, hornet up here. I'm gonna go, go for it first, first, and then I'm gonna move straight, straight to that redeemer. redeemer. Third target. Fourth target. Thunder Lake. Steel Legacy. For a silly time, the hurricanes would be priority targets. And hurricane first. Thunder Lake. Copy. Uh, this is Rhinos. We are fully set up, ready for when you guys need us. Drop. Slightly effective, Thunder Lake. I've already made my drop, going to back towards Thunder Drop. Seth is coming in for a drop as well at the moment. Back shield's down on Thunder Lake. Just make sure you're stealth on the way. I don't know if you have shields on the way, but just be aware. Roger that. Let's go shields down. Let's go evasive. Seth is currently in. Ground control right now. Let's check down. Let's see if we can board. Careful when you're running that. Kind of far out there, Rick. I'm catching it. Skip's on reeling. Yeah. Kind of. It's, it's like a little far away when I was. B-lining on Sony. He's B-lining on Sony. Really effective. Stark and Rector back on site. Coming towards Skunk. Really effective on Hurricane. Hurricane's on Skunk. 
Request the situation yeah, cool. update on the air. I want to get this hurricane, keep this thing out. I don't want it in the sat now. Yep, yep. Good job, good job. Let's go back up, back up, back up, back up, everybody back up. Can Jafaro, if he drops party, please get a re-invite? He's having issues with party markers. Okay, drop party for Jafaro and Sonny, I'll re-invite you. Daylight. And while things were quiet on the ground for the moment, in the skies the hammerhead was returning from its repairs and things were about to heat up. Right in front of us, see the Redeemer with those 85Bs? Right there. Let's go fuck this Redeemer out. Let's go show it why uh, we don't bring it to things. Uh, the air sounds like it's still clear, right? Pinned one Redeemer on our nose. Yep. Start, Start engaging blocking. Mrs. Arnold. Close that distance on that Redeemer. Okay, get, get that pre nose ready. Girl. Going after Skunk Girl. Push in, push in. Fire on the Redeemer. Engaging. Everybody fire on that Redeemer. Thunder like a Tony. Darver, no joy. Good effect, good effect, good effect. Raptors like Ray Lobaco were also arriving on the scene to overpower the enemy Redeemer. Stark effective. What, no joy? Request the situation update on the air. Air is great. We are, we are actually slightly tested now, but we have air dominance. Everybody focus on that back shield if you can. Effect. Oh yeah, seeing that. Dark under concentrated missile fire. Hey, firm. Come in low and quiet. Redeemer lost the sail. Fire. Pin two. Run the Redeemer. Push up at him. They're engaging the Raptors. Set his tower pick to the fine. Nice merge. Make him eat it. Redeemer splash. splash. Splash Redeemer. Everybody look for Stark's tails. Look for Stark's tails. Team 3 under the command of Iowa GFC were making progress towards another ingress point of the rack. Yeah, I did not load, unload his ammo or anything, but probably uh, air probably looks to be mostly secure. We expect him to be amassing from okay. another point right now, but we are uh, we have to rely on the uh, 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 Understood, yeah. Multiple engagements on the ground at this point, but we have uh, succeeded at every engagement so far. You guys are doing great, by the way. You guys yeah. are doing outstanding. Yeah, we got right. Jin, we got Barbin. All right. Iris taking point. Ira, Jin, and Barbin were going in. Firing in. Got one. Finish off. Got another, got another. There's one on right side, one on right side. Down. I was backing, I was hurt. I dropped my grenade on the track. Jin's inside, breach. Enemy occupied both sections of the rack, however, and this entry point is vulnerable to attack from the rear section of the rack. Guys, friendly's been engaged from the rear part of the rack. Friendly team is being engaged from the rear part of the rack. Look out there, see if you can spot anyone. The is responding. Barbara's taking shots from the rear. Barbara's gonna take the shots from the rear. Barbin was not in cover as the team came into fire. Kitty. Barbin in cap. Team 2 is on the move to uh, Mini White Kitty. You guys are probably going to be in the best position to provide sniper support for um, Team 3. Team 4, if you could move on that part of the rack while they're looking at um, Team 3's position, that would be a huge help. Just hold that position. Jen's holding. Now Team 3 had a foothold. Alright, so they're probably firing from the aft, from the rear. Somewhere behind. I was taking shots from behind. Upper deck, middle rack, uh, middle back. That's six more than zero. Yeah, so that needs to be firing from the other side. Is that friendly um, uh, missile fire? It was not friendly missile fire, and in the skies above, enemy targets were continuing to enter the airspace. Steel Legacy, Steel Legacy, Super Hornet, first primary, then we'll turn to Silver. So they merged. So they effective. Really effective. Splash. Effective and splash. Nice splash. Good, good shit. I took a little red on We're gonna we're gonna get the super hornet first time. We're gonna merge on him right now. Get ready. Yeah. 
Target number 10. Effective on Suborn. God, that thing is fast. He's so red. Tyron, do you see any other uh, contact? Yeah, go for mine cap, he's in the Eclipse. I don't have his pit or whatever else he's Get ready, my friend. He's already kind of turned. He's dead. Okay. This is Team 3. Uh, we're about half down. They are securing the upper floor of the front of the reclaimer. We're having trouble breaching in. Alright, Iris pushing in. Iris taking point. I don't have a grenade launcher to disappear. Yep. I'm just gonna have to suck it up. Okay, Iris sees nothing on left. Nothing on right. Alright, Iris pushing right. Jim's pushing left. One, one, far, one far. Iris down, traded, traded. Iris needs pickup. Thank you. Center room clear. Down the... Yep. Alright, right, just going up. Picking up on the scan. Clear. This is Team 3, we have control of the... of the upper portion of the reclaimer. So south side is ours. Outstanding work, Team 3, outstanding. You guys oh, did an incredible job, amazing. Half of the wreck was secure. The rear section is arguably the most difficult to assault though, and with all of the activity in the skies now, there was no telling what reinforcements might make it through. Go on, so we get intercept. Cat wing is engaged with the Super Hornet, he's running real fast. How's your wing? The silly wing engaged with a cart to wall. Uh, wing is good, uh, heavy is out to repair at the moment. Echo wing is staying above the AO. Could be hooked. You're with him. Good. Good shooting, Tyron. Steel Legacy on Raylo. Gun Gun Steel Legacy. Our pilots were securing kills in the sky, and the question had to be asked how much of their ground troops remained in the AO after the initial engagement? <laughs> eliminated a lot of enemies, at least 10 if not 15 guys we killed, so I think they're probably going to do a ground regroup right now, they got absolutely decimated. Several small ships would try to land. Permito visible. 3 kilometers. Skunk entry weapon range. I'm with you Skunk. Skunk effective. Shields down. Skunk highly effective. Good splash. Anvil Hawk. Ping box eight kilometers west. Splash hawk. Good kill. And soon after, a Hercules was heading in. M2 spotted. He's on an M2. Yeah. Really effective. But the hammerhead was also at low altitude right now and ready to move in. No joy, poor side. Off the nose. Oh shit. I just flew right between Skunk and the Hammerhead with like a four foot gap. That was. It lit up. No joy, Starboard. Effective. Hammer it. It's not a bad time. Splash. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. There we go, there we go. Let's go, light that up with the cannons. Oh, wings pull off. The Hammerhead rear turret was equipped with C788 cannons for the purpose of providing ground air support. And for silly time, close encounters with the Hammerhead were not over. Oh my god, this Hammerhead. Oh my god. What's up? I'll show you later, but I just watched them, like, maneuver <laughs> just right underneath me. <laughs> 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 oh, he doesn't know I'm here. He's gonna. Oh shit! 
100%. Oh my god. Team 4, if you were to approach on the uh, port side, uh, rear entrance, we have that covered from our position right now. Um, what's the ground situation? Areas uh, doing fine. We've taken control of the front section of the rack. Everyone on the ground, just be aware that rear section of Hull is still not under our control. As we planned an assault on the rear section of the rack, the hammerhead above will check the surrounding terrain for any sneaky enemy ground troops. If you see anything uh, moving, All right. spot it. Yeah, stop. I think I killed a guy. Nice. Yeah, are there ground targets in the tail section of the wreck? Enemy targets? I see I'm seeing body. some triangles down there, but like nothing that I can hit. If they're not no, moving, do. they're probably just because the, the triangles also are corpses. Yeah, yeah the there's a lot of bodies corpses. down there. The yeah. triangles might also be friendlies if you're uh, not sure. <clears throat> As they departed back to the skies above, Sony would request that each of the ground teams check themselves for invisible players. This is a problem that would become much more prevalent later on. Be advised, Shaq is clear. Roger, we'll do. Uh, one dead bogey. Good work, guys. Can every team lead please do a, an invisibility on. check on every member of the Roger. team? I'll put you on the side then. Reinserts from Team 4, like Lego 96, were arriving. Team 3 is good. Team 4 is good. Little lift. I can see you, Arvis, when you're good. Team 1 confirms all raccoons visible. KD, do you want Team 4 to try and clear the north end of the wreckage? Yes, oh, please. Okay. That would be incredible. Uh, I'll let him know. So, Team 4 were volunteering to take on the rear section of the wreck, but as they prepared, the missing party marker problem would strike again. There is someone in the middle of uh, the reclaimer. Ooh, hold on. Hold on. I heard There's something. In front of you. Yeah. Alright. Okay. We got a go. Hey, stop firing. You're firing at each other. Oh, no. Alright, let's go. Is he okay? They're fine. Yeah, they're fine. They're fine. They're fine. They're fine. They're fine. They're fine. Okay, I'm on your six. Alright. We were watching the airlock on the side of the wreck, but could only see so far inside from atop the ridge. To enter this way, there is a ledge to be vaulted, leaving one vulnerable to attack. We need to reposition Team 1 to cover the inside of the airlock. We need to drop down a little so we've got line of sight on this, because uh, they're going to need to climb. Um, so we need line of sight into that, that entranceway. Team 4, Team 4, hold. Hold while we get line of sight directly into that entrance Watch so that uh, we can like climb right. into they're trying to get line of sight into the into the door for us. Mm -hmm. I got that. Same uh, This is oh no, this one's a drop, isn't it? Shit. Yeah. Oh, yep. really? Oh, 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 coming up behind me. Get a med gun out. Med oh. out immediately. Yep. Thank you. We can't see the, the crash site. Right, I want everybody get over on this side of the building, so we're next to the thing, so we have less. Uh, Possibility of being okay. shot. I'm gonna watch mm -hmm. the center to make sure we don't get a flanker. Yep. yep. Haku, I am observing. I can see into that entrance right now. I don't see anyone right now. Um, it's very dark in there though. Copy. We'll uh, we'll risk it. All right. Around. I'm ready to return fire if you take fire. Yeah, I'm ready to cover as well. But they're gonna. Yep. Don't get up there. Don't get up there. I got a hit, I got a hit. Get me out of the hole. Vlaz was in a better position. Team 4, the uh, the enemy raccoon is on the going in, he was on the rear section of the room. Rear section of that room. Near the elevator. Paku had been lucky and he could be revived. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm just blind firing, I got Be advised, there is a, uh, there's an enemy in that door on the left hand side. He's hiding next to a crate. Do they need a crate launcher? There's a lot of crates. Any idea? Position? Jamboard? How can you storm grenades in? Roger. 
Taku, we need you back up. Rhino 1 will provide fire support through that door. Say when clear. Uh, clear. hit someone because they were healing. Centurion Rhino 1 was attempting to fire into the door, but the angle was just a little too wide. And Team 2 on the opposite mountain were about to come under attack as well. Spurs team is re uh, receiving fire. Spurs yep, team. We're taking fire, we don't know where. Let's have a look who we've got here. Okay, fingers, Naruto, and keep covering for Haku down there. Yeah, uh, Clevel, Lego, try the other door. Yeah. On the other side. Team 4 was splitting to cover two of the entrances. You have tractor beam? Team 3, Team 1. It might be a good idea for us to push on the rear section of from another direction as well. And we'd spot the enemy reinforcements coming over Team 2's original position. Team 2 had moved to the adjacent hill as the rising sun has compromised visibility. White slide. Big mountain. Big White mountain. slide, I think. I see him. Uh, Command, yeah. uh, requesting cat on. on White Mountain, Engage. we have uh, enemy retreat uh, on White Mountain. For how... Requesting Kaz on White Slide, there we are, enemy raccoons moving along the top of the snow up there. What's the set? Copy, Emirate on road. As ships overhead moved into position to provide air support on the mountain, LEGO 96 had to cross through the middle of the wreck to climb the airlock on the opposite side. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yep, they're on the right hand side of that door now. This door's not gonna be able to get through. Oh shit. Got fire? Yeah, I, I saw some shot from this side though. Yeah, get good and low so we can ping it. White mountain on the trip, enemy raccoons moving along the top rope. Mail me not's lighting it up already, so. Yeah, look for what mail me not shooting at. So is the hammer hit. Okay. I got I got one right here. Left side, left side, targeted, not That's a good one. Let's go. Light him up. <laughs> that poor raccoon. Yeah, I see him on the hill right there. I think he's dead. Yep. Uh, they got this door pretty held down. We're splitting to try and see if we can get to the other Happy door. Dead. This side of the wreck also has a ledge to mount, and LEGO was aware of a strange bug at the moment, causing players to turn around during a vault. Remember, when you vault inside, you will be backwards for uh, some sort of bug. Eyes on, eyes on yeah. Royal's marker. Pushing another grenade in. Yep, throw another. Grenade out. Breach. LEGO, I don't have it. Breach, breach, breach. LEGO, go, 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 go. Uh, They're yeah. shooting me. They go down, there is one down. Uh, right on the door. There's three in that room. The defenders had repelled the assault, resulting in several raccoon deaths from Team 4. Be advised, Haku full dead. What's the status of the rest of your team? Lego and Haku are full dead. Team 4, we're gonna send Vlad down to assist you. He's bringing a grenade launcher. He's bringing a grenade launcher to assist. Vlad would take a grenade launcher from our supply box and head down to Team 4. And fears over missing party markers would cause some confusion even on legitimate enemy kills. You're up, you're up. Thank you. Looking, looking pretty. Jin, are you alright? Con contact, contact. He's getting off. Contact from where? From where? By you, right, Ira. By me. Is that Quibble Co? Make sure it's not one of ours that you shoot. Oh, yeah. sure. There's no he's party. Above. There's no party marker. Left I don't side. See anybody? Oh, oh you see Quibble Co over there. Oh yeah, someone is down over here. Well, oh, good shot. I've good shot. A... And Vlad had made it down the hill to position at a point that the grenade trajectory would maybe be optimal. Someone move around to like the front entrance of that rear section and push in here because we've got their attention on this doorway. But as he repositioned, he'd fall victim to friendly fire. Is there any chance one of your light fighters could come? Could come? Fuck, bro, I'm down. I'm down. Uh, they're, okay, they're on the. They're on the. They're also on the south side as well. They're covering the south side. Team three, team one. Uh, yeah, we just had a friendly fire kill uh, on Vlad. Vlad was just killed by your team, it's not your fault, obviously, the market situation, but... In a very sudden move, Team 3 would volunteer to storm the rear section of the hull. Uh, Team 3 is pushing into Northern, Northern Reclaimer. 
Okay, good work, guys, good work. And from Jin's perspective, holding the front section, we cannot see the fight, but we can hear the comms. You pour it, you can't go in, go in, go in. I got him, I got him, I got him. Push, 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 push. Oh, there's one more, there's one more. So I'm there's left, two I'm down. Left, I'm left. I got him, I got him. Oh, I, I got him, I got him. They are not wearing uh, our armor. Team 3, keep a surprise. Team 4, the remainder of Team 4, I guess, push in. Team 1, regroup. Regroup on the hill. Team 3 were able to withstand the resistance of the defenders and capture the rear section of the hull. Team 3 has northern part of Reclaimer. Yep, Team 3 back. has northern part of Reclaimer. Outstanding, guys. Good work. Outstanding. You guys have been incredible. Can I get some help over here on the uh, south side? Yeah, I'm yeah. by myself, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I mean, you guys There's just... There's going to be uh, supporting Jin. Uh, Jin, he's for Jin. Got bad, make no one. You guys yeah. just leave me back here. <laughs> Raptors, uh, raccoons. I believe the entire wreck is now under our control. We do have several raccoons in need of reinsertion. So we now held the entire wreck, but be assigned in fed were determined to get reinforcements into the AO. Terrapin, two tone level, 1.7 kilometers. Get on it, get on it, get on it right now, get on it right now, get on it right now. Eyes on, eyes on. Suck effective. Silly effective, silly effective. Cast, 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 cast. Kill it and cast, kill it and cast. Kill it and cast, kill it and cast. Silly Wing has killed a Terrapin full of ground troops. Be on the lookout for more Terrapins. And in the third part, we'll see their counterattack and the server starting to get a bit strange after so much action. In part one, we ran a giveaway for an LTI cartoile complete with Harmony Paint Scheme. Well, I am very pleased to announce we have a winner. That winner is Gobi X, with the comments seen on screen right now. Congratulations, Gobi. I will drop a reply on your comment with instructions to claim your prize. And as always, a big thank you to CIG for sending these prizes our way. As always, I want to thank all of you at home for watching and all of our amazing patrons who you can see on screen right now. Without these very generous people, none of the videos here on the channel would be possible as patron support is what allows me the time it takes to edit these videos together. And I am very grateful to each and every one of you for helping me to keep the channel going. We'll be back with part 3 of this battle very soon.